Um, hello everyone. Today I'm gonna teach you how to put on a spoon rock suit. See, one of the suits is a beta animatronic, and the other one is a spoon rock suit. See, the thing is, a spoon rock suit can also double as an animatronic. Okay, so let's get into step one on how to use a spoon lock suit. So, the first step of what to do is get it into spoon lock mode. So, with this Golden Freddy suit right here, there should be a button somewhere. The button should be right here on the back of the head. So that, that sets them into spring knock mode. And if you want to put them into animatronic mode, you just press the button again. And it will set them into animatronic mode. Okay. Next, you have to make sure that the spring knocks are loosened up because if they're not, then let's just say it will, it will be pretty painful. I heard that if you don't loosen up spring knocks, then it can start pinching you and it can start like getting hot in the suit which doesn't sound good so all you have to do is like with this suit all you have to do is press the nose and then that loosens up the spring knocks okay now just gotta get inside the suit okay so the suit feels fine. See, when you're wearing the suit out in the restaurant, make sure not to take off the head or make sure anything falls off the suit because let's just say some kids might be a little bit disappointed that they'll oh, friend the animatronic isn't an animatronic. You know how kids are. So anyway, thanks for Spring Lock Testing 101. And now I just have to get out of the suit. Okay, we have a bit of a problem here. The, the suit isn't coming off. It's hard, I can't take it off. Man, I'm going to have to contact William about this. Hey, what? Uh, why? Why is it getting hot in here? Oh no, the spring locks. Oh no, I think that. Could, no, they can't be failing. Why would they fail? Wait a minute. Unless if I were in animatronic mode. Oh no. I have to run fast. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, my God.